Residents of Ibi Town in southern Taraba State are worried about the pace of work at the federal government's 57 billion naira Ibi bridge project. The bridge, which is about 2.4 kilometers with a road network of 8.4 kilometers, when completed, is expected to link the state to the central and southern parts of the country. Correspondent Owolabi Adenosi compiled this report. The major road linking Taraba and other parts of the country through Benue and Tukum, Ukari local governments, is now a dangerous route to travelers due to communal conflicts between Tib and Jukum. Many travelers have either been abducted or killed by militants along this highway. This may soon be over now that the federal government awarded Ibi Bridge. Ibi local government in Taraba state is located on the south bank of Benue River with a population of over 100,000 people. The main economic state of the people is farming and fishing. Visitors of the community within the local government have to make their way across a difficult mountainous terrain and long stretching plains. The poor road networks in the area has affected the daily income of locals striving to transport their produce to other parts of the country. They see the construction of Ibi River Bridge by the Barrier Administration as a reprieve. Work at the project site is expected to take two years to complete and this is of concern to Ibi residents. I would like to advise our federal government to come and put their eyes on this job because this job is not going well. And so many people are losing their lives. Some of the people are in Ibi are saying that uh, that bridge, it will not be work. It will not be completed till the Buhari complete his regime. The Vice Chancellor of the Federal University will carry Professor Jude Samani Rabo once the project quickly completed, as it will reduce the danger of students and staff of the institution who often fall victim to kidnappings and communal conflicts involving the thief and Juku. He observes that the absence of the bridge had been a major impediment in boosting manpower for the university. He believes its early completion would enhance movement of visitors to the university. Besides this, the staff that would have to come through that, uh, pass through that uh, river to get to Mokodi, to Gari. Students too. We have a lot of students from Abuja Axis, from Plateau, from Bochi. From the Vice Chancellor is not pleased at the slow pace in executing the project and is worried it may eventually be abandoned. I'm happy that the contract has been awarded. I'm happy that Mr. President is concerned. It's not unusual for uh, projects to be embarked upon and later they are abandoned. Indeed, I understand the bridge was earlier abandoned that way. The Ibi bridge had been abandoned for 60 years before the present administration awarded contracts. The project on completion will be of great economic value to the state and minimize unnecessary attacks on innocent citizens blind the hotspots in southern senatorial districts.